they calling me dangerous. Taking a throne and I'm gonna maintain it. I gotta go down, it's just one of the great. So anybody got a problem with me, can't fake, kick it, kick it, politicking. I ain't worried about it, I know God is with me. Your peace of mind is worth a dollar fifty. But last year I made seven million, then I had to do a single show. Should I too much up at Coca Cola for the check that cut me at the Super Bowl? On my life moments is a Super Bowl. Dr. Dre, he got a Super Bowl. Last night I was texting Jack Dorsey, that's the perks you get from being super dope. Welcome, sports fans. Thank you for joining. Anthony Davis grew up in Chicago. No doubt. Good stuff, Allie. Thanks. So let's take a look at the Los Angeles Lakers starting lineup. The big three for this team out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at forward. Patrick Beverly out there with Thomas Bryant. And for Denver, Gordon is the four with the Joker in the middle. Kevin Herter out there with Jamal Murray. And it's Porter in at the three, the small forward. And we've got a pair of teams here that know a thing or two about ball movement, Grant. Yeah, they really do. I mean, there's a great feel that these teams play with. Two of the smartest teams in the league. They focus on sharing the basketball and keeping everyone involved. This is a matchup for the purest. Now, here is James. He's been contributing over 15 a game. Every organization needs team first guys like Patrick Beverly. That's a terrific pass. Fantastic replay we just saw of the mobile one drive. And I love the way he played downhill on that drive. Love the attack mentality in a close game. Shot on the wing. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. The Nuggets have gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Outside Herter. Pass to Gordon. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. Nice look from Kevin. Intelligent and unselfish. Here's James. Denver grabs the miss. This game following their win against the Rockets. You have to credit the game plan going in, especially at the offensive end, where they were just so relentless. They knew that the arena would be rocking. And if they could execute well on the offensive end, they knew they could quiet down this hostile crowd. They have really found a rhythm here early. Four for five to start this game. You know, Anthony Davis has had his share of injury struggles, having to miss valuable games at times. Now here's Westbrook. He had 16 in the win against the Timberwolves in Minnesota. And not only was he creating for himself, he was setting up teammates with good shots. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Gordon can't hit. You know, the thing with AD, he's always bounced back from his injuries. I totally agree with you, B.A. It's a true credit to his resiliency, physically and mentally as well. For the Nuggets, Najee comes in for Gordon, and it's Highland in for Herter. Here's James. And that makes him three for four. He's looking good. Strong pass there to set up the basket. Down low. Here's Jokic. And Jokic throws it down. Good awareness by Murray. Sees a hole in the defense and sees the guy ready to exploit it. Here's Westbrook. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. And as Westbrook gets older, he's indicated that he's not looking to change how he plays, Grant. And that can be a double-edged sword, B.A. You love his aggression and confidence, but you wonder how his game will hold up as his athleticism goes. And the Lakers making a change here. Walker's checked in. Now a timeout called by Denver. Russell Westbrook's ranks on the all-time list are incredible. He's in the top 100 for points, rebounds, Assist and steal. And don't forget, he's a triple double king. And here in the first, approaching three minutes play. An open look for Smith. Doesn't go for him. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. And with Westbrook, is there anyone you could see breaking his triple-double record? Yeah, I think Luka Doncic has a chance. He's already in the top ten on that list and has a long career ahead of him. I remember thinking no one would break Oscar's record, but Russell did it. Here's Westbrook. And he lays it in off the breakaway. This has been just a dreadful start for them defensively. Not good at all. 
Left side, Brown. Pass to Highland. Outside, Brown. And here's Smith. Six to shoot. The Nuggets need to get one up. The Nuggets with another miss. For Los Angeles, they've gone an impressive eight of nine. Here's James. And he drops it in from the low post. James has got eight points. <laughs> Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. Here's Highland. Walker covering. Looking to end the run. And he gets it to go. Here's Toscano. Here's Davis. Again, the Lakers score. They're not wasting any time putting their stamp on this game. What a start. Play calling has been fantastic. They've been a step ahead of the defense since the opening tip. And so it's Los Angeles with an impressive six. Fans, please give a big round of applause. We welcome you back to second quarter action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been one-sided so far. And for the Lakers, this has been the game they wanted to have. They are looking engaged so far, especially on offense. And that has helped them build an advantage here. Playing with good focus and good energy. Porter Jr. and Gordon at the three and the four. Murray out there with Kevin Herter. And it's Jokic in at the five spot. That's the group in the game for the Nuggets. You know, Grant, a positive trend in this league right now. Teams would rather risk losing a game than sacrifice a player's health. Well, it's all about a player's health, B.A., when it's all said and done. A player with minor injuries are usually held out now, sometimes even against their own will. A much different situation than when I was playing many years ago. And Gordon with the big finish. And the athleticism of Gordon helps on the offensive glass. I just love when he goes after the second chance scoring opportunities like that. A moment to hear from Ali LaForce. Nicole Jokic again has won the league MVP, but he's not one to beat his own chest. He said, quote, I never think about it. I didn't come here to be the MVP of the league. I always think that somebody's better than me, and I want to compete to beat them. Just by that mentality alone, I'm the underdog every time. Brian? Well, it's working for him, Allie. Thanks. Yeah, nice touch from the big man. Gordon just burrowing himself into the paint and going to work. Westbrook with the miss. Miss opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Well, when we talk home court advantage, you think the Nuggets have the best in the NBA? I think so, B.A., and it has to do with geography. Denver is at altitude, and that's hard on your body. Trust me, I know. And they're isolated from the rest of the league, so it always is a long trip out there as well. Here's Herger. Second shot opportunity. Gordon can't hit. This is the shot you want right at the rim. He just couldn't deliver. The shot by Reeves, no good. Those are precisely the looks this team is trying to create. You know, if you get the ball to the right guy in the right spot, more often than not, you're coming away with points. And the dunk by Jokic. And I love how Jokic is just relentless on the glass. His effort level has been special. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. And this game, the first chance they've had to see Denver. And we're about two minutes into the second quarter here. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Here's Walker. Gets it to go from 18 Morning feet Walker. away. They're playing great team basketball. It's good movement and sharp, crisp passing. So it'll be Boston two free throws. Bryant. He was fouled in the act Thomas of shooting. That's his it's going to be on Thomas Bryant. Second well, this is back. what they want from Herter. Be assertive and Denver. make plays. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Lakers. Right now, it's their passing game, and it's been on point. Doing a great job of moving it around and getting the ball to their shooters. Another thing that's gone well for them is the mid-range jumper. <laughs> it's been falling with ease so far. And down it goes. Two points. 
Walker's got four points now in the quarter. I mean, he's ignoring the scoreboard. He just keeps coming at him. There's two things they rely on him for. Being competitive and bringing energy. Here's Najee. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Here's Christie. Deflected! And here we go. The Nuggets on the fast break. Pass to Najee. Here's the three. And again, Denver no good. The Lakers have gotten over 50% of their shots to go. Five for nine in the second. The shot by Reeves, no good. Missing that one helps out all the analytical guys from the mid-range. And what an aggressive move to the rim. He's really trying to fire up his teammates right now. Boy, it's not hard to feel inspired after a teammate makes that kind of finish. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. And it gets even worse for them. I mean, he just waltzes down the lane, extending their advantage. Huh. Not good. A uncontested shot at the rim. You have to compete at all times. Uncontested look. Can't fault the shot selection. He's money from there. Beverly shot off. Denver has gone 0 for 3 from deep to begin the second. Pass to Highland. From downtown. Goes up again. The shot by Najee. No good. Now here's Walker. He's guarded closely. And he makes it. Walker's got his third bucket of the night. And he's been an ideal teammate tonight. He's really creating plenty of looks with his passing. There's been an emphasis on ball movement, and he's been a major catalyst. So as we conclude the first half, a fairly one-sided game. Thanks, Allie. After the break, we'll see you right back here to begin quarter number three. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure. LeBron James had it going on in the first quarter. He had eight points, two rebounds, and one assist. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Lakers. Well, the bench came in and helped them run away with this one. Tremendous job of getting loose, getting open, and drilling shots. You always want that spark off the bench. And these guys deliver. And you, big fella. Let's get your thoughts on the Nuggets. Just bad interior defense from them throughout the half. They're getting pushed around, not protecting them. Allowing easy looks. That's the kind of the deal I love. And that should do it. Just about ready for the second half here. A big comeback is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. You gotta like what we're seeing from LeBron James. I like how they control the tempo and play to his strengths. And many of those quality shots have been jumpers. A very high percentage of those in the first half. And so in the game for the Lakers, the big three for this team out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at forward. Thomas Bryant out there with Patrick Beverly. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. He made that drive look easy. But that had a high degree of difficulty. And yes, Westbrook can find points from anywhere. He just needs an opening. And just one of the most impressive titles in league history, guys. The 2020 Lakers winning it all in the Orlando bubble. A testament to LeBron James and that team. Here's James. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. You know, that 2020 bubble title for the Lakers. What made it so difficult? You know, B.A., the mental grind of all that time in the bubble. Three months in the same place. NBA players are used to being in four cities in a week. So it really was a different kind of challenge for them. Jokic. And the dunk by Jokic. Does it get any easier than this? Just give Jokic the ball, and he'll take care of the rest. And it's good for two. Bryant's got his second bucket of the night. And since the halftime break, their offense has just been on another level. You know, the coach has had something to say about that. No question, they've settled in and executed brilliantly. Here's Porter. Blocked! At the point guard position, Patrick Beverly is a great shot blocker. Jokic finds Murray. And Davis with the block. James with the ball, and Jokic picks him up defensively. 
Wasted no time with that shot, but it's off the mark. After hitting three straight, they finally miss one. But you can see the rhythm coming out of the half. Terrific play. This is why you run your offense through him and live with the results. Bryant, no good. For Denver, they've gone three of seven here in this third quarter. And Aaron Gordon, Grant, growing up in the heart of Silicon Valley, San Jose. Yeah, Aaron, using that to his advantage, involved with some apps. Now, we've seen a lot of players getting into the tech world. Great to see guys like Gordon branching out into business. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Well, you know it takes courage to draw charges. Guys get trucked all the time, and they still call a blocking foul. You think more of those should be no calls, Grant? You know, B.A., courage is the right word. If you're willing to step in there and sacrifice your body for the sake of the team, you know what? If you don't give them a charge, I prefer the no call. I like that idea. You have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Reason why, lack of focus, lack of communication, which led to second chance points. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Well, the league and the world have endured tremendous challenges in recent years. Commissioner Silver said, quote, We found a way to keep going under very difficult circumstances. It required enormous diligence. To keep playing throughout the pandemic, we are particularly proud of that. Brian? Hey, the show must go on. Thanks, Alec. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Chalk up two there. Green's got his first bucket in this one. I mean, they've been relentless. Just keep getting shots at the rim. Here's none. And it's Denver with a rebound. Gordon's got rebound number eight now. Outside Porter. This one for three. Second chance shot. Rebound, Anthony Davis. The Lakers have gone four of eight in the third. Here's none. And off the left side of the rim, it swirls in for him. And the Lakers lead by 13. Terrific pass. That's the unselfishness you want to see. Beverly's all about the team. Smith passes to Gordon. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. Gordon's got 10. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. That's Three a points. shot the defense looked like it was willing to give up. Big mistake. Two-second difference between shot and game clock. Here's Smith. And he banks in the layup. Smith's gotten four this quarter. They just look so overwhelmed inside. You know, that's why they continue to get attacked. To the left side wing. Here's Gabriel. And the Lakers Winning hit again Gabriel. from deep. There's 14 seconds left in the third quarter. Smith passes to Green. And it's hammered home by Green. Taking what the defense offers up. Smith with good vision there. Finds the open man. Davis can't hit. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. In command with a 13-point lead at the end of the quarter. They just can't miss right now. Every shot they're taking, you assume, is going in. And now we have a moment to reveal our State Farm assist of the game. And I'll tell you what, this was a no-brainer tonight. Take a look at the precision on this feed. Couldn't place it any better. This is why you preach teamwork. Some of the most spectacular plays are the ones where guys are feeding off one another. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same for the first three quarters. The backcourt forum is Highland and Murray. Michael Porter out there with Zeke Nagy. And it's Jokic in at the center position. That's the group on the floor for Denver. The awareness of LeBron knows where everyone is on the floor at all times. Offensive rebound. Knocked loose. Here's Nagy. Oh, three chances on that possession, but they just can't find a way to score. Here's Walker. And that one off the back of the rim and in. There's a reason Russell Westbrook ranks among the greatest ever in terms of assists. He excels at getting the ball to his open teammates. Here's Murray. And here's Porter outside. They get it back. Controls the rebound and the putback. And those second chance buckets are major bonus points if you can get them. Here's Westbrook. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. Probably not the 
shot they had in mind. But you can't fault him. He had a clean look. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. For Los Angeles, they've gone two of three to open the fourth quarter. Good. And the Lakers lead by 15. They've now had assists on each of their last three buckets. Here's Murray. He can't get it to go. So the Lakers will take it the other way. You want to talk about ugly? This team is losing, partly because he hasn't drained a shot all night. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. And no lack of aggression on that move. Good for the 2K drive. And this is exactly what you love to see. A big, not letting up, keep on applying pressure to their defense. Now a timeout called by Denver. And you look at the career that LeBron has put together. One of the all-time greats. Amazingly lived up to the hype he had coming out of high school. Gordon, he's checked in for Denver. Herter comes in for Jamal Murray. On defense, the Lakers. 17-point game. Here's Highland. That one drops, and it comes off an assist from Porter. Porter's got his third assist of the night. And the immense pressure LeBron has had since day one of the NBA. Many others would have folded for him. Yeah, very true, B.A. The expectations he had were just insane. Anything less than a top five player all time would be a disappointment. That's not fair to ask of any player coming into the league, much less a high schooler. Jokic, good. Down in the paint, Jokic knows how to take charge, getting past the D and to a look. The Lakers have gotten five of six shots to go in the fourth. The shot by James, no good. Denver has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Gordon, and it goes! As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. At the line for your And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. It's all about the mid-range game. It has been a real difference in this one. Taking what the defense has given, and it's been paying off. Well, something else that stands out is how they've shared the ball. I mean, they're getting a lot of their points from sharp passing. Here's Highland. And the three off target. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. And there's James on the assist by Walker. They came out and had a statement win with their performance tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Lakers. Check out their assist numbers. They didn't get stuck in isolation. They got the ball to the guys who had the best matchups. And this will give them their seventh win of the year. And what a huge performance it was for Russell Westbrook. Got to respect the leadership he showed today. Made great reads and distributed the ball accordingly. Excellent effort on the road. They've literally sucked the energy out of this arena. And when you're on the road, you can't be tentative coming into a game like this. I thought their aggressive approach was the difference. That one drops for him. There's 42 seconds left in the fourth. James can't get it to go. Pass to Highland. Now Gordon shoots from 14. They get it back. Tries again. Can't capitalize inside. He goes up strong, but he is met with resistance. I think that surprised him a little bit. Walker for three. And the Lakers hit again from deep. 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Highland. Pass to Jokic. Excellent D there from Bryant. Shoots. Basket is good. That's an inspired ball club. They fought hard, and during the most important moments, they made big plays. Especially during this last run, which ultimately put the game away. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. A statement road victory. So impressive. Statement indeed, B.A. It was in enemy territory, but they controlled the game and took the crowd completely out of it. That's how you win on Allie, thank you as always. And that'll do it, folks. So for Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson, thanking everyone for watching tonight's game. So long, everybody.